What's up guys, JBA here, and here's 10 awesome iOS 10 jailbreak tweaks. If you enjoy this video or find it useful, be sure to show some love by hitting that like button, sharing this video, and subscribing to the channel. If you want to see behind the scenes or whatever I may be up to, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat at jailbreakormy. Now, this video is for those of you who are brave enough to jailbreak using the beta method. In no way do I encourage you to jailbreak using that method. It is much safer for you to just wait for the official release. Once you lose your jailbreak, the chances of there being another jailbreak anytime soon is very unlikely. Now I have to point out that the device that you see in this video is on iOS 9, but all of these tweaks are in fact working on iOS 10. I'll leave the official tweak list in the description. With that being said, if you choose to proceed or just want to stock up on your tweaks for the official release, let's get into it. Power Tap is a tweak that everyone should have on their device. It gives you the ability to respring, reboot, and enter safe mode right from your power down screen. You activate this tweak by holding the power down button just as you would if you were trying to power down your device. Next we have Alkaline and this tweak allows you to theme your battery indicator. It comes with a few themes already but if you search Cydia, you will find countless more. Just be sure to check the compatibility. Now this is one of the more simple tweaks on the list and it simply rounds the corners of your dock. It's pretty unnoticeable to be honest but if the rest of your setup has rounded edges, this will look fine. Swipe selection is a tweak that makes editing text in iOS extremely easy. It's so hard to get the little magnifying glass to go where you want it to go in iOS but with this tweak installed, you don't have to worry about that anymore. Now, I can't throw in Swipe Selection without throwing in Swipe Selection Pro. This tweak gives you everything that the free version does, but with a few more options, such as the option to quickly turn off the tweak and choose where to activate the tweak from. Next we have Cylinder, and this tweak gives your springboard animations whenever you change the page. This tweak is far more customizable than the tweak barrel because it allows you to use a combination of animations in addition to having them appear randomly. Aquaboard is a fun tweak that gives you water ripple animations on your lock screen and springboard. It adjusts to any wallpaper and you won't even know it's there until you touch it. This Miss Progress is a tweak made specifically for Cydia, and unless you return to Cydia instead of respringing or rebooting. This could be useful if you're watching my video and you see a few tweaks that you want to install, but you don't want to respring right now because there's another video that I uploaded that you haven't seen yet, or something like that. This next tweak is a simple one and it gives you a more realistic view of your signal strength. The cool thing is that the bars actually move individually when your signal strength changes. Finally, we have Double Cut and this is an old tweak that saves you time when entering your email. After you enter your email in the tweak settings panel, simply double tap the add symbol to enter it. Now, even though this tweak is for emails, you don't have to use it for that. You can enter pretty much anything that you want here and it would work just the same. That's it guys, thank you for watching. If you guys want to know what tweaks and things work best with the iOS 10.1.1 jailbreak, subscribe to the channel. Like this video if you enjoyed it and follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat at jailbreakormy. Until next time, stay weird, get curious, and be you. Later guys.